Apple's event yesterday was really, really cool. I was very, very impressed by the iPad Pro and iPhone 6S and iPhone 6S Plus with the new 3D Touch. And yes, the new Apple TV 4 was very impressive too, but I don't play games and I don't watch television, so it's nothing for me, unfortunately. But as I said, the iPad Pro was very, very impressive. So fast and powerful. You can do a lot of stuff with the iPad Pro. I really like it. But unfortunately, it's too big for me because I want to hold the device in my hand while working on it so the iPad Pro you have to have a cover of some kind for example the awesome looking new keyboard cover from Apple for the iPad Pro and you have to use it on a surface for example your knee or a table or something so it's much like you have to do with a Microsoft Surface and to me it gets too limited by that because you can't have it with you and working while walking for example or have it with you on your toilet while working and so on so I don't like that you can't hold it in your hands while working because it's too big for that but yes I will probably buy the new iPad Pro but not this year because I'm happy with my iPad Air 2 it's so fast and powerful still and it's portable but uh, I will probably buy the iPad Pro next year. I will wait for the next generation of the iPad Pro. But I will definitely buy the new iPhone 6S Plus because it's so impressive. So much faster and more powerful thanks to the new A9 processor. And I'm sure it will have 2GB of RAM even if Apple didn't uh, say that on the event. And uh, I will buy it because the new 3D touch is so impressive and also the camera is so impressive and especially the front facing camera the 5 megapixel front facing camera uh, it's perfect for doing vlogs like this I like that a lot and I really like the new 3D touch especially that you can do uh, different kinds of things uh, directly on the app icon for example the Facebook app icon that Apple show us you can just force touch down on the app icon and and get some choices there you can uh, uh, check in to your timeline on facebook you can post to your timeline directly from the app icon i really like that and more and more apps will uh, support this new 3d touch i'm sure of that we will see a lot of apps that use this uh, functions this technology the 3d touch technology i really like it and it's definitely not the same as uh, android has this is something different this is something else and this is much more powerful than what android has so don't get that discussion going because this is something else much more powerful okay that was some of my thoughts about what we saw on the keynote yesterday apple's keynote i will definitely do more videos about this in future vlogs i'm sure of that okay bye